Hi friends, it's your ECD Hub coach Kayla. Today we're going to do some art. Let's see what art project we're going to make today. Today's art project is going to be a teddy bear picnic. The first thing we're going to do for our teddy bear picnic is make a headband with teddy bear ears. I'm going to use a regular headband that has some cat ears and turn it into a teddy bear headband. Watch to see how I do it. You need tape, brown paper, scissors, and a headband. The first thing you're going to do is draw two big ears, just like this. It'll look like that, one ear, two ears, and then you need to cut them out. I used a grocery bag this time to save paper because grocery bags are brown. So it works out. I have my two ears. Just like that. Oh, look, one side has the grocery side, so I can just use this side. Then, after your two ears, you're going to take the headband that already has ears and you're going to put two pieces of tape on it. I'm going to take a piece of tape and loop it like that and stick it on an ear and stick your ear on and push so hard then you're going to do the same on the other ear make your loop put it on the ear and stick it on that might not be enough tape so you're going to turn it around I'm going to get a long piece of tape like this and stick it on top just like that on both ears and then you have your teddy bear headband this is what your teddy bear headband will look like when you're all done now you're a little bear if you want and your family says it's okay, you can use a little bit of makeup to put a black nose right there like a teddy bear. I'm not going to do that today though. All right, next we need to make the materials for our teddy bear picnic. I'm going to make them on the computer. You can make them on the computer or you can draw them. I'm going to make some cookies and some plates. Watch how I make them. I'm going to make chocolate chip cookies. To do that, I'm going to go to Insert, Illustrations, Shapes, and find the oval because that's our circle. Because if you press Shift while you hold down and pull, you'll create a circle. Right now my circle is blue, but we know cookies are not blue. I'm going to put, click this arrow and click the box that has the black around it with the white center. Then I have my circle cookie. I'm going to have four teddy bears at my party. So I need four circles. So what I'm going to do is click the circle, right click it, copy it, and then paste it to make another cookie. I have one, two cookies. And then so I'll paste it two more times to have four cookies for all my teddy bear picnic guests. Now we need to put chocolate chips in our cookies. So we're going to go back to insert on the same shape. But this time, draw little circles. And we can make them all black like that. And you're going to copy it, right click, copy, right click, paste, and you have lots of dots. Another way to paste is by pressing Control V, and you can get them faster like that. And decorate your cookies all around.
I need more dots. I'm going to click, click Control V. So many more chocolate chips. That one is too big. I only want four on this cookie. Then I'll add some down here. And then, if you want, you can add special shapes to your cookies by going to Insert, Illustration, Shapes. And you, let's say you want a star on your cookie. Click and drag, and you can get a star. I'm going to make mine black. I'm going to copy it. And then press Control V to paste it. And then I have some star chips on my cookie. So now I have four cookies for my teddy bear picnic. After this, you're going to print it out and then cut them out. And then you'll have four cookies. If you drew them, you can just cut them out. And then we need some plates. So what I'm going to do is press insert, pages, blank page, so we have a new page over here. And I'm going to make some plates by going to illustrations, shapes, Let's do some hmm, rectangle plates. We need four rectangle plates. Well, I'm going to, let's see, like this. Will that be big enough for my cookie? No. Maybe I can make one big rectangle plate for all the cookies, just like that. I'm going to click the arrow down and find the one with white in the middle and black on the outside. And I have my plate. You can print out your plate and cut it, and then you can color these however you want. Great job, friends.